Hello, new to growing here. I thought I'd just show you these uh, beetroots that I've grown in this 10 inch pot here. Uh, there's two in there now that are quite big so I thought I'd pull them out today and then maybe eat them for dinner. Uh, there's four in here in total, two are ready to take out, one's not and one's tiny. D doesn't look like that's going to do anything. So I'm just going to pull these out quickly, show you, so you can have a look at them. So if you want to grow any beetroots in pots. Because I think these are about ready to come out. It's not, it's not huge, but that'll be alright. I've got some more I can pull out of the raised bed. And I've got another one here. Looks like a white one. I don't know why I ended up with a white one, because I only bought the purple ones, but... There we go, if you can see that. And then the other one here, there's just a tiny, tiny one on there. So I'll leave that a bit longer, see if it gets to any size. And then there's a really tiny small one there, a very small one there. I don't think they're going to do anything. So, anyway, just thought I'd show you them. It's a quick update. And while I'm here, I'll just show you a couple of other things. Over in the corner there, I've got some mangold growing there. It's been a bit windy, so I just put some plastic cups around them just to uh, keep them standing upright. Just take my camera here. Right. There's me, there's my runner beans, flowering nicely. Most of them are all the way up to the end of the sticks. Got some more here as well, some more runner beans. And don't know if you can see, but there's me. There's actually my first runner beans beginning to grow there. So, be getting some beans anyway. I'll just quickly show you this. It's a big, big round concrete pot which I had potatoes in, five seed potatoes, which I dug out today, and I've got five kilograms of potatoes. And I'll put a picture on at the end, just so you can, just so you can see. And just another quick look over at the raised bed. Can't really see any dirt now, it's completely full up with beetroots, carrots and parsnips, swedes and potatoes and some more potatoes in pots. So that's just a quick update. Thanks for watching, bye bye. Just thought I'd show you this because uh, quite a few people have had trouble growing red onions. Uh, they seem to go to seed. Well this is the first time I've tried growing them. I bought a set of onions from the garden centre, put them in and this is what they're looking like now. Uh, they've got pretty big so I think I'm going to pull this one out. I've already pulled one out and some other veg uh, for dinner. So let's get this one out. Get out of here. So, that's two red onions I've pulled up. And then here, uh, some carrots that I pulled up and some beetroot. And that's what we'll be having for dinner today. Anyway, I just thought I'd show you the red onions because I know a lot of people had trouble growing them, but I didn't seem to have any trouble. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye bye.